What are dynamic engines? Well, I'm here to introduce that to you. Do I have an awesome new feature for you. Dynamic engines are a new way to license FME in 2020. Instead of buying a standard fixed FME engine, dynamic engines only consume credits when they're in use. So what does this mean? Well, it means that users can launch as many dynamic engines as they want, whenever they want, but only pay for when they're busy. This unlocks many new possibilities for organizations that use FME Server. If your data integration workflows involve unpredictable spikes in demand for processing power, or if you're required to complete infrequent large data lifts, then dynamic engines are a solution that you should explore. They enable you to have instant access to extra capacity when needed. They also allow you to harness the power of parallel processing, which dramatically reduces processing time without the perpetual cost of many engines, which would otherwise sit idle. For example, they make sure that the users of your FME server apps don't experience slow response times, even if a lot of people are hitting them all at once. If you work with streaming data, you don't need engines to sit idle watching for data. Instead, these workflows can be assigned to dynamic engines running only when needed. If you're using FME for application integration, when these workflows are kicked off, they can require a lot of processing power for a short time. Any bursty workflows like these are great uses for dynamic engines. Rather than buying the maximum number of engines you might need at peak times, plan your standard engine purchases based off your average capacity requirements, and then add dynamic engine credits to handle the peak loads. You have one year to use these credits, and you can purchase more as needed. Now let's take a quick look in FME server for how to navigate to and check how many credits you have. So here in FME Server Build 2020.1, click on the Licensing and Engines dropdown. Click Licensing, and at the bottom in the Dynamic Engines panel, you can see the remaining credits. Safe Software is offering 100 hours of Dynamic Engine credits with every FME Server trial license as of Build 20504, so you can try it out yourself. To view your Dynamic Engines, navigate to the Engines tab. You can see which engines are Dynamic Engines by the Type column here, and in the suffix of the engine name as well. You can also launch additional engines in this tab by simply changing the count within the FME server web interface. These engines are only being used when they're processing jobs, so you can have as many launched as you wish. It's important to consider the technical aspects required of your machine, as performance may drop if many dynamic engines are launched and run at the same time on a single machine. I hope that provided you with a good understanding of what dynamic engines are. There's a link to the knowledge article about how to get started with dynamic engines in the description box below. Tune in for more videos on dynamic engines coming soon. Please reach out to sales at info at safe.com to get started. And as always, please let us know if you have any feedback. We love hearing from our customers and ensuring that what we build works best for you. See you in the next one.